With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Here our question is a simple pendulum of length L is given here. Oscillates about the mean position as shown in figure. If the total energy of the pendulum is E, the velocity of the pendulum bob of mass m at point P is. Here different options are given. That is. 2e divided by m minus gl by h square by l root over and e by m 2gl divided by this is d square root over and e by m 2g d square by l root over okay now here we consider this is our position p okay at this position let us consider the velocity of particle is v right now this distance is given d so we can consider here a angle theta so that we can take this distance is uh, this total distance is l okay so this distance is total distance l and if we consider that this is our l cos theta this is our l cos theta this distance so height will be how much that is from here to here height will be l into 1 minus cos theta okay and from the figure we are going to find out what is the cos theta okay so sin theta will be how much that is d divided by l so what will be the cos theta here cos theta equal to root over of 1 minus d square by l square okay so if we assume that this d is very very small so that we can further modify it as 1 minus d square by l square whole 1 by 2 right so using the binomial expansion 1 minus d square by 2 l square okay this is the expression for cos theta okay now we are going to use this expression further to find the velocity okay now what will be the total energy at this point point p that is total energy e equal to sum of kinetic energy plus potential energy okay and kinetic energy is given by the expression half into mv square plus potential energy equal to mg into height h okay this is the height h okay so height h will be how much that is l into 1 minus h l into 1 minus cos theta okay so we have the value that is cos theta we have already found the value for the cos theta so we can put here that is 1 by 2 mb square plus mg l into 1 minus this is 1 minus this is 1 plus d square by 2 l square okay 1 1 will get cancel out right now we are getting our total energy as half into mb square plus mg into d square divided by 2 l right so from here we can easily find out our velocity component that is half mb square equal to total energy minus m g d square divided by 2 okay now this is v square equal to 2 e divided by m minus this is m will get cancel out only g d square divided by l okay so this is the expression for velocity square okay now only velocity will be how much that is whole okay root over of 2e divided by m minus gd square by l this is the expression for our velocity at the point p okay if we check out our option then second option is our right answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today